DNC, and they have been good and supportive friends to us as well. Bob Williams is with us here. Mike, you didn't hear. I asked, did I have a one minute rule also? So, if I have to follow every rule, I follow every rule. I don't um, think Mike can follow the one minute rule. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, so I don't know. I'll follow you anywhere tonight. All right. First of all, let me say thank you to Belle for her tremendous leadership. <laughs> and for her work on behalf of the Asian Caucus at the DNC, and for her support of Chairman Kane and her support of President Barack Obama. And let me also thank Mike Honda, who's our Vice Chair. Yeah. 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 I have the pleasure of considering a friend, and a person, along with the other congressional members here tonight, who took an historic vote on Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. able to allow our President Barack Obama to sign a bill today that will really transform America as we know it and will transform our health care system as we know it for generations to come. This is a great opportunity and a great night to be here, uh, to have the opportunity to look at what has happened through the Democratic Party. And only Democrats could have done what was done today. Uh, you look at our President, he showed a great deal of courage and a great deal of leadership. He never wavered. When people were telling him you should have a small bill, when you should not be as inclusive to try to cover 30 some odd million Americans, he said, no, I'm gonna to continue to fight the good fight and move this ball forward. And because of the leadership of our president, we now have a health care bill that will allow children with pre-existing conditions to be covered immediately. We have a health care bill that will allow 26 year olds to stay on their parents' policies. We have a health care bill where we will no longer have a cap on coverages for people who are sick. And insurance companies will not be allowed to drop individuals who are sick. This is what Democrats are about. And this is what real leadership is about. And I think because of the leadership that our president has shown, the leadership that our congressional members have shown on Capitol Hill, the congressional members that are sitting here today, Senator Inouye, who just left, who is a person who has been steadfast in making certain that Democrats do the right thing in the Senate. We have a platform that we will be able to run on in 2010 for re-election, a platform that is necessary in order for us to be successful. You look at the fact that we have 36 gubernatorial races, 36 senatorial races, and every member of the House running for re-election. Everyone in this room needs to be a part of the process as we move forward for 2010. Remember he said every member of the House. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Particularly the congressional members that are sitting in this room. <laughs> and the President has made it clear that we are supporting all incumbents. And so with your support, with you all being the validators, with you all being the individuals that raise money, but you all being the people who go out within your communities and talk about the great things that we've done. I think the Democrats have a tremendous opportunity to keep control of the House, keep control of the Senate. And whenever you look at these midterm elections, whoever sits at the White House, these elections have not been necessarily great for the individuals who are sitting there. But I think we have a real opportunity to change that dynamic, to do something that is different because of the leadership that, said that our president has shown and the tremendous leadership that the individual has really shown. And so I look forward to working with you all, as I said last year, I say it again this year, to move an agenda forward that I think is in the best interest of this country, to move an agenda forward that I think is in the best interest of the Asian community. And I have a great job because I get to work with people like Bell and Mike Honda, and I get to meet people like you all in this room tonight. So thank you again for allowing me to be a part of this celebration that you do every year. Thank you.